Hey, what's up guys? So welcome back to my YouTube channel. I received so much support on my first video, so I was really inspired to do a second video. And uh, thank you to everybody that was commenting and uh, interacting with the video with me and giving me all your feedback. I really appreciate you being here. Now let's go dumpster diving. There's some orange shoes over there, guys. But check that out. It looks kind of nasty. It's been here for a while. Plus it's touching the bottom of the dumpster. So that's a no. Now let's check out this other one. There's a little tray for ice cubes. That could be a yard sale item. A mouse. It's missing the bottom part. Um, this thing, I have no idea what it is. I think it's for like air conditioners. I'm not too sure. Check that out. There's a, a clip on board, but it looks to be cracked in the center. So I'm actually just going to take this right here. The only reason I'm taking this mouse is because um, I sell like boxes of electronics and like very cheap and people buy them. So I just, I'm just probably going to throw that in the box of electronics that I have right now. Um, some people use the parts that are inside or they know how to fix them or I don't know for what reason, but they buy them. <laughs> Let's see if there's anything else in here. Should I jump in there? Yep, it's broken from right here. So I'm gonna have to leave this one behind. It would have been pretty cool to take, but yeah. Everything else needs to be trash. I need to get out of here. <laughs> Ooh, this one has a whole bunch of stuff. Some cards. An umbrella. Another umbrella. Oh, there's more over here. I wonder if they're broken. <laughs> this one seems pretty cool. This metal thing, I have no idea what that's for. A hat looks pretty cool. Put him in my car and bring my car closer. Let me see what I can find. Okay, for some reason, uh, my uh, cell phone fell off the tripod, but I found a whole bunch of stuff in that dumpster. I don't know how long it was recording, but check this out. There's a whole bunch of like really cool stuff. There's some hats. This thing right here seems to be vintage. It plays music. There's a whole bunch of cards, beanies, this Batman belt, and uh, umbrellas, and... Uh, so many cool stuff. I'm gonna put all of this in my car and we'll check it out later when we get home. Check this out. This is really cool. All right. Okay guys, so that was a thrift store. They throw away a lot of stuff. I'm thinking that most of their items, their donations don't even make it out on the floor because they receive so many donations. And when you go inside that thrift store, everything's like so crowded and packed. The racks are full with clothes. So a lot of the donations end up in the dumpster and that's kind of sad because they could be donated or given to somebody else or just marked down, you know, like 50 cents, a dollar, a quarter, instead of going to the landfill. Again, the landfill has already so much. So why give it more? I don't get it. But uh, we were able to save a couple of stuff and uh, now let's go and check out more dumpsters. Okay, so this one has to be one of my favorite dumpster. It always has stuff in here. Maybe not today. What is this right here? 
Oh, check this out. Hollywood frames. Photo frame. That's pretty cool. Why would they throw these away? If they were to mark them down like for 50 cents, I'd be anything uh, they would sell. There's some more over here. I'm gonna grab them. So I never been to that dumpster before, but I see some stuff like hanging out. I don't know if it's clothes or what it is, but I'm gonna go check it out. And it's gonna be my first time ever going to this dumpster. There's the chair. I think it's a rocking chair. All right, so there is a jacket and it's a nice jacket. It doesn't seem to have any hose. It says San Francisco. I'll take it would you take it leave it in the comments below I think it could be donated I don't want it to end up in the dumpster and if somebody throws it in it's gonna get all dirty because like I said it rained yesterday so if it gets thrown in there it's gonna be nasty and nobody's gonna take it so I'd rather take it and uh, find somebody that's gonna use it guys so yesterday it was raining here in Texas and check out the day today it's very sunny it's perfect for diving and uh, so some of the things that we find might be a little bit wet but it's all right because I have a washer and a dryer at home by the way let me know in the comments where are you from uh, my first video I had somebody comment from Canada which I thought that was really cool because I'm in Texas and Canada is like really far away so yeah let me know where you are from in the comments check out those cats <laughs> <laughs> is that the cat for my first video they're just relaxing let's see what's inside this mystery box and there's nothing it kind of seems like the trash truck just passed or something since they're kind of empty a whole bunch of leaves all right guys so in my city it is legal to dumpster dive but Make sure you check out your local laws first before diving because if a dumpster has uh, this sign right here that says no trespassing or no dumpster diving, you will get in trouble. So <laughs> check out your local laws before diving. But like I said, in my city, it is legal as long as it doesn't have one of those signs. Guys, I've been sweating a lot and I don't know, dumpster diving is like a workout. Let me know if you agree. Uh. What are these? Worms? This is a pet store, by the way. But I'm guessing all those worms are dead. I think it's like food for fish or lizards. Uh, this box is really heavy. And it seems like somebody threw those branches here, which I'm guessing it's probably an illegal dump because a pet store wouldn't have all that. But what do I know? These are live crickets. Is there crickets in here? All right. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna walk away from this one. There was uh, some kind of fish tank here, but it is broken. There's glass here and yes, I forgot my gloves again. I need to put them in my car so I won't forget them next time. I think I'm just gonna walk away from this one. It's, it's too much. Hmm. A ceiling fan, but I think it's broken. And I know those white racks, they're pretty expensive. People will buy them, but it's not gonna fit in my car. And it seems to be in great condition. It's not like rusted or anything. The fan I'm gonna have to leave behind because it's probably broken. Let me check out this one. This one's empty. Ah, 
Oh, there's an ice cooler. But that's not going to fit in my car. And it seems to be kind of dirty. I know I can clean it. But it's just too bulky. So I'm just going to leave it for someone else. Uh, let's see what else is in here. There's a hanger. Bubble wrap. A broom. <laughs> this room seems kind of cool. I'm going to take it. So a hanger and a broom. Uh, let's see what else. Pretty sure you can guess what store this is. It's like a little organizer for the makeup. Oh, I love this bubble wrap. This bubble wrap is actually really good. I'm gonna take this for uh, shipping, shipping supplies. Grab that one as well. So I'm gonna end up taking this display rack because I feel like anybody with a small business wants this organizer. Uh, you can't buy these at the store as far as I know so it's pretty good it's in good condition just got to clean it a little bit uh, all right so I'm gonna try to check out those clear bags over there usually they have good stuff so I climbed in here but there's really nothing but boxes and trash but I found all this chalk which I'm gonna try to take some chalk is fun I'm pretty sure they can sell at my yard sale or I can give them away. I put them in this box and I'm saving them <laughs> from the landfill. It's actually pretty cool to hang stuff. I see some shoes over there. I think I want this. This is cool. You can hang a whole bunch of stuff. You see that? That's a maggot. I'm definitely not taking those. I mean, they could be clean. They can be washed, but there's even a cigarette in there. You see it? So I'm not gonna mess with that. I try to avoid anything that's like very nasty. Oh shoot, a whole bunch of cords. An HDMI cable, I believe. I'm gonna take all these cords. People buy them on my yard sale. People actually need and use these, so. They don't need to go to the landfill. Okay, so we got some cables. But anything this has, this one has more. More new cables. More cables. Some kind of charger. And let me go put this in my car just in case somebody comes out and tells me to leave. All right, so I'll be back. There's more cables over here, guys.
I'm gonna put them in this tote bag that I found. Slender. Okay, so now I'm gonna get that earring organizer. I believe that's what it is. Uh, it's pretty cool. And uh, I think it would sell. All right, so that was very random. We have a whole bunch of cords, uh, organizers, and way before that, we found clothing, uh, toys, shipping supplies, and chalk, a whole bunch of chalk, and so many items that I already forgot what we picked up. So we might check out one more dumpster or two or three, I don't know. We'll just go with the flow, wherever the wind takes us. And uh, yeah, so we found a whole bunch of stuff already. It's been a great day so far. And uh, once I get home, I'm gonna show you everything that I found. And uh, yeah, I'm excited. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and this content. And remember to subscribe if you haven't. Thanks for being here. Okay, so here I put together several bags of like certain items and food that we're gonna be giving away. Um, I try to make them pretty packed. Uh, chips, snacks, a drink, and just like, I don't know, things that I feel that are good to be uh, giving out to people. So yeah, let's go find some people to give these out to. Do y'all want uh, some snacks that I have? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Do it's like chips and stuff like that. You're welcome. Get chips. All right, guys, so we were able to find people to give out those snacks to, and I'm just glad that we were able to rescue them, and now somebody's gonna enjoy them, and now let's uh, go home and see what else we found. Uh, I'm gonna lay out everything for you guys so y'all can check out my other finds. Hey guys, okay, so now I'm back home, and now I'm gonna show you what we found today in the dumpsters. All this stuff was in the trash, destined to go to the landfill, but we saved it. Let's check it out. There it is guys, everything that we found today in the dumpsters. I actually gave the white rack and the long black organizer to my parents. They're gonna be using it for personal use, but this is the rest of the items that we found today in the dumpster. There was a whole bunch of, uh, I guess, greeting cards and birthday cards and get well cards, thank you cards inside the dumpster of the thrift store. So all of this right here that you see are uh, cards that I'm gonna be using as thank you notes because I do sell on Marketplace and eBay. So when I ship, I'm gonna be writing thank you inside the cards. I'm gonna be using them. And uh, hopefully my buyers like these cards. And now also it was uh, kind of like a Batman theme at the thrift store dumpster because there was this belt, which is really cool. Apparently it's like brand new. Now this part right here, it's falling, it's falling apart, but I'm thinking I can fix it with super glue. Sorry, I'm peeling because I went to the beach. <laughs> so that's why my arm looks like that. But I think I can fix it with some super glue or if not, just take it off completely. If not, uh, worst case scenario, just uh, sell the buckle by itself. It's pretty cool, it's metal. The Joker beanie, the Batman beanie. Check it out. It's really cool. Definitely somebody will wanna buy this. This is actually a cool beanie, this one too the belt buckle so this is not trash this is not trash <laughs> uh this beanie it's pretty cool too um i heard that these could be kind of like kind of expensive well not super expensive but you know uh worth more than just a dollar also uh in the thrift store dumpster there was a whole bunch of hats i still need to wash them uh it's been a busy morning sorry but I mean, they're in okay condition. Nothing that a washer can't fix. Uh, there's hats. Now these little kids shoes has this uh, adapter from the store. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to cut through that. But yeah, there's some kids shoes. Um, what else from the thrift store? Also a telephone, a remote control, or some kind of control. I'm not too sure what this is for. Let me know in the comments if you know what that's for. 
this which i think is pretty cool i had never seen before and uh this was also in the thrift store dumpster it plays music i'm thinking it's vintage uh but that's pretty cool it plays music also in the thrift store dumpster there's a uh, plush which i think it's uh really cool follow your dreams if you were looking for a sign to follow your dreams this is your sign follow your dreams portable uh toilet seat i had never seen this before so these apparently you just put them over a toilet so you don't have to sit or i guess use uh sit on the public toilets so i had never seen that also these uh bins the blue one the pink one it helps people organize items. So that's from the dumpster at the thrift store. Also, uh, this thing right here for clothes. Uh, there's a whole bunch of organizers for the closets, uh, protectors for, I guess, dresses or t-shirts or expensive clothes, outfits. Um, you just pretty much put the dress or the shirt or whatever you want. Uh, in the hanger and then you just zip it up and the top of the hanger comes out from the top so yeah there's like three of those in here uh let's see what else i thought this was pretty cool i think it's an organizer for for items whatever you want to put in there and i think it's in great condition just gotta fix it a little bit i can't uh put it out perfect because i'm recording with one hand and holding it with the other hand but you can kind of see it. Pretty cool. All right, so in another dumpster, I found a whole bunch of chalk. Check it out. Somebody's going to want this. Chalk is fun. And uh, yeah, there's no reason it should be thrown into the dumpster. It's chalk. <laughs> and uh, what else? Over here, we have all these uh, picture frames, photo frames. They're brand new, still in the bag. You can take pictures like that. Okay, so remember this thing that spins? Uh, I'm probably gonna sell it and uh, make some money off of it. It's pretty nice. People can use it to uh, to place at their yard sales or if you have a small business, you can put like earrings or bracelets, anything that you wanna hang on this. And it spins and there's a lot of space. So yep, somebody with a business will want this. This thing right here, I think it's for the waist. Uh, the store was asking $5 for it, but I'm like, if you're going to throw it in the dumpster, why not mark it a dollar? Somebody will buy it. 50 cents, somebody will buy it. And you'll make some money. The store will make some money. And on top of that, they'll save something from going to the landfill. But remember in another dumpster, there was a whole bunch of cords and electronics. Um, on another dumpster, I found this mouse, which like I said, I have like a box where I put a whole bunch of electronics and people buy them. I sold the box like very cheap and people buy the boxes, I'm guessing because either they use the parts that are inside or they know how to fix them. So yeah, that's gonna go in there. Most of these cords, uh, I'm gonna sell them on my yard sale. Let me know if you wanna see a video of me uh, selling at the yard sale to see like what I sell, my interactions with customers and yeah, let me know if you want to see a video of me doing a yard sale. This tote bag, which I think it's kind of ironic, the message. I'm using fewer plastic bags. So somebody had this tote bag, but they threw it in the dumpster. It's kind of ironic, right? <laughs> also, this little bin right here, well, it's actually a large bin. It was uh, inside the dumpster at the thrift store. Uh, this bag right here too, which I use these to put like plushies in there. So whenever I sell them, I can find them easily since it's see-through and it zips. So that helps me get organized. This chair right here, I thought I had recorded it, but apparently my camera wasn't recording. And uh, this broom, which I think it's very unique. I've never seen a broom like this. Let me know in the comments if you have. And also this San Francisco jacket, which it's in great condition. It's not torn, it's not stained. Somebody will want to use this jacket. 
Oh, and there you can see my dog. One of, <laughs> one of my dogs, Cookie. It is mind blowing to me how some people actually thought that this was trash when people will buy this, people need this, people will use these items. None of this is trash and it does not deserve to rot 